Welcome, fellow enthusiasts, to a captivating exploration into the world of one of Hollywood's most intriguing personalities Mark Curry. Today, we embark on a riveting journey delving into the layers of the renowned actor's life, uncovering the secrets behind his net worth, the luxury that graces his garage, the opulence of his mansion, and the myriad facets that contribute to the allure of Mark Curry. As a seasoned journalist, I am thrilled to guide you through the tapestry of his success. Shedding light on the man behind the fame, and unraveling the fascinating narrative that defines the intersection of wealth, lifestyle, and celebrity in Curry's extraordinary journey. Mark Curry is an American actor and comedian who has a net worth of $4 million. Mark Curry is best known for playing Mark Cooper on the 90s ABC sitcom, Hangin' with Mr. Cooper, which aired 101 episodes over five seasons between 1992 and 1997. Mark is also well known for hosting the syndicated variety series, It's Showtime at the Apollo. Among his other credits, Curry had recurring roles on The Drew Carey Show and In the Cut and a main role on the Nick at Night sitcom, See Dad Run. Mark Curry was born on June 1, 1961 in Oakland, California as the youngest of nine children. As a teenager, he attended St. Joseph Notre Dame High School in Alameda. For his higher education, he went to California State University, East Bay in Hayward. In the late 1980s, Mark Curry burst onto the television scene with his infectious humor. Making his mark through stand-up performances on the iconic variety show, It's Showtime at the Apollo. This marked the beginning of a journey that would solidify Curry's status as a multifaceted entertainer. Throughout the early 1990s, Curry continued to showcase his comedic prowess with stand-up sets on popular platforms like an evening at the improv, and one night stand. His unique style and quick wit captivated audiences, laying the groundwork for a successful career in the entertainment industry. From 1992 to 1994, Curry took center stage as the host of It's Showtime at the Apollo, further cementing his presence in the world of television. Simultaneously, he embraced a new challenge by stepping into the shoes of NBA player turned gym teacher Mark Cooper on the ABC sitcom. Hangin' with Mr. Cooper, a role that would define his career. Hangin' with Mr. Cooper, which premiered in 1992, featured an ensemble cast including Holly Robinson Pete, Don Lewis, Nell Carter, and Omar Gooding. The sitcom followed the humorous escapades of Mark Cooper as he navigated the challenges of being a gym teacher, bringing laughter and life lessons to viewers. The show's popularity soared, and it ultimately ran for an impressive five seasons, concluding in the summer of 1997. During the peak of Hangin' with Mr. Cooper, Curry showcased his versatility by making guest appearances on other hit series such as Living Single and Martin. His ability to seamlessly integrate into different comedic environments solidified him as a sought-after talent in the television industry. As the 1990s came to a close, Curry continued to diversify his portfolio, demonstrating his comedic chops in a stand-up special featured on Comedy Central Presents. This marked the end of a decade that saw Mark Curry rise to prominence, leaving an indelible mark on the world of comedy and television. As the new millennium dawned, Mark Curry continued his vibrant career by delving into various television projects, showcasing his versatility and enduring appeal to audiences. In the early 2000s, Curry took on the recurring role of Robert Solard, the boss of Drew Carey, in the fifth season of The Drew Carey Show. This marked another successful chapter in Curry's career, as he seamlessly integrated into the established ensemble of the popular sitcom. Expanding his repertoire, Curry made noteworthy appearances on For Your Love and took on a starring role in the Disney Channel original movie, The Poof Point. His on-screen charisma and comedic talent were further highlighted as he stepped into the role of the host for the Comedy Central game show, Don't Forget Your Toothbrush. Captivating audiences with his infectious energy, the 2000s also saw Curry making regular appearances on a variety of game shows and variety shows, solidifying his status as a go-to entertainer. From 2002 to 2003, he became a recurring guest on Pyramid, bringing his humor and wit to the classic game show format. In the following years, Curry hosted the variety show Animal Tales from 2003 to 2004, showcasing his ability to engage audiences in different entertainment formats. In 2004, Curry found himself frequently gracing the squares of Hollywood Squares, proving his adaptability across diverse television formats. Not one to shy away from challenges, 
He also took on the competitive spirit in the fourth season of the reality game show, The Mole, displaying his willingness to explore new and exciting ventures. Transitioning back to regular scripted series, Curry made memorable guest appearances in episodes of Less Than Perfect, Fat Actress, and Tyler Perry's House of Pain. This return to scripted television further demonstrated his enduring appeal and ability to seamlessly integrate into various comedic landscapes. The year 2011 marked his presence on the reality series, Celebrity Ghost Stories, and the ABC family teen drama, The Secret Life of the American Teenager. This diverse range of appearances demonstrated Curry's ability to engage audiences across different genres. Building on his momentum, Curry returned to The Secret Life of the American Teenager in 2012. Hinting at his ongoing commitment to television, simultaneously, he embarked on a new venture, playing the main role of Marcus Barnes on the Nick at Night sitcom, See Dad Run. This sitcom, featuring Curry alongside Scott Bio, Alana Ubach, Ryan Newman, and Jackson Brundage, enjoyed a successful run of three seasons until 2014. The chemistry between the cast members and Curry's comedic flair contributed to the show's popularity. Amidst his sitcom endeavors, Curry made a triumphant return to stand up with a set on Gotham Comedy Live. This marked a homecoming of sorts, as he seamlessly blended his comedic roots with his evolving television career. Further expanding his repertoire, Curry took on the main role of Pastor William Winters in the short-lived sitcom, One Love, sharing the screen with Cheryl Lee Ralph. The year 2015 saw Curry guest starring on the sitcoms, Instant Mom, and Black Jesus, underscoring his ongoing presence in the television landscape. However, it was from 2019 to 2021 that Curry took on a more substantial role as Principal Glass. The head of Maya Angelou Magnet School, in the Netflix sitcom, Family Reunion. This family-centric show, starring Tia Mowry, Anthony Alibi, Talia Jackson, Cameron J. Wright, and Loretta Devine, provided Curry with a platform to showcase his comedic timing and warmth. Even while immersed in the world of Family Reunion, Curry took on the recurring role of Wade in the seventh season of the sitcom, In the Cut, starring Dorian Wilson and Ken Lawson. This dual commitment highlighted Curry's ability to balance multiple projects and remain a dynamic force in the television industry. Since 2018, Curry has also regularly performed stand-up comedy at the Hollywood Improv. Mansion in Oakland, California, in 2001, he invested in a unique residence nestled in the Claremont Hills, an investment that has proven both enduring and valuable. Purchasing the property for $575,000, Curry's real estate venture has appreciated significantly over the years, currently valued at approximately $1,300,000. This distinctive home, surrounded by the lush embrace of trees and custom plantings, epitomizes modern convenience blended seamlessly with rural serenity. The open floor plan invites residents and guests into a spacious living room with two sitting areas, a dining room, and a large deck that offers breathtaking views of the hills and the bay. The property's aesthetic appeal is heightened by the presence of nature, creating an oasis of tranquility. A focal point of this residence is the newly renovated Dream Kitchen, equipped with three sinks, two dishwashers, a warming drawer, and a 48-inch wolf range. Beyond the kitchen lies a verdant green yard, adding an element of natural beauty to the property. The thoughtful design extends to the living spaces, with two bedrooms and one bathroom on the main level as well as an upstairs suite that boasts a master bedroom and bathroom, a walk-in closet, and an additional room with a porch suitable for use as a bedroom or den. This home emerges as a perfect setting for hosting social gatherings, offering an ideal space for cocktail parties and gourmet dinners. Its proximity to open spaces and hiking trails further enhances the allure of this residence, providing residents with opportunities for outdoor activities and exploration. Beyond its financial value, the house embodies a harmonious blend of modern living and natural beauty, making it not just a property, but a cherished home in the heart of the Claremont Hills. Home in Studio City, California. In October 2010, Mark Curry made a significant real estate investment, purchasing a home in Studio City, California for $691,000. Fast forward to today. And this property has not only proven to be a wise financial move but has also transformed into an abode worth approximately $2 million. Let's delve into the details of this stunning modern traditional home, situated on the Studio City Hill. The house has a total area of 1,726 square feet, 
including three bedrooms, two bathrooms. Nestled on the south side of the avenue, this gated oasis is a three-bedroom, two-bathroom haven that seamlessly blends functionality with luxury. The house offers breathtaking views, making it a standout in Studio City. Recently painted walls breathe new life into the interior, creating a fresh and inviting atmosphere that welcomes residents and guests alike. The open floor plan facilitates easy movement between indoor and outdoor spaces, a design choice that enhances the overall living experience. The heart of the home is the gourmet chef's kitchen, adorned with shiny Viking appliances, quartz countertops, and a welcoming eat-in bar. Al fresco dining becomes a delightful affair with two separate terraces, each possessing its own unique character. The courtyard, featuring a cozy gas fireplace, sets the stage for memorable game nights against a backdrop of sweeping views that stretch for miles. The expansive master bedroom beckons with upgraded luxuries, including a spa-like bath complete with a rain shower and massage jets. Large windows flood the room with natural light, offering not only great views but also a connection to the lush backyard, revealing a sun-drenched hill of green space. Beyond its aesthetic delights, this home is equipped with modern amenities that enhance comfort and functionality. Wired internet is thoughtfully installed throughout every room, providing connectivity at every corner. Security is a priority with the inclusion of security cameras, including the outstanding ring doorbell. The garage boasts recently added polyurea flooring for durability and style. The backyard's lush beauty is maintained effortlessly through an upgraded and smart watering system. New smart outdoor lighting adds to the evening atmosphere, creating a serene ambiance. For relaxation, a brand new six-person hot spring hot tub offers an escape from the demands of everyday life. Upgrades extend to essential components, such as a new water heater and upgraded bathrooms with sleek shower doors. Raised gutters with gutter guards contribute to the home's perfect comfort and functionality, ensuring a seamless living experience. It is known that the house has been rented since 2018 for $13,000 a month. This house is really beautiful, isn't it, my audience? Mark Curry's lifestyle is not just marked by his successful career in entertainment but also by his exquisite taste in cars as exemplified by his ownership of two luxurious and stylish vehicles. The jewel in Mark Curry's automotive crown is the Mercedes-Benz S-Class, a pinnacle of automotive excellence that epitomizes luxury and performance. Priced at around $120,000, this opulent sedan is a statement of sophistication and refinement. The Mercedes-Benz S-Class boasts cutting-edge technology, plush interiors, and a powerful engine, providing an unparalleled driving experience. From its sleek design to its advanced safety features, owning the S-Class is a symbol of status and a testament to the owner's appreciation for automotive craftsmanship. Moving on to the next gem in Mark Curry's car collection, we find the Lincoln Town Car. This classic American luxury sedan has been a symbol of elegance for decades. With its distinct design and spacious interiors, the Lincoln Town Car offers a comfortable and stylish ride. While the price of a Lincoln Town Car can vary based on the model year and condition, it has historically been known for delivering a premium driving experience. Known for its smooth ride and attention to detail, the Town Car represents a blend of classic design and modern amenities. Mark Curry's choice of these two cars reflects not only his affinity for high-quality automobiles but also his discerning taste in vehicles that combine performance with comfort. Business In addition to his work in the entertainment industry, Mark Curry has ventured into the world of book publishing. He authored a book titled, Dancing with the Devil, How Puff Burned the Bad Boys of Hip-Hop, where he shares insights into the music industry. This move into literature represents a diversification of his creative endeavors. Beyond the aforementioned areas, Mark Curry has explored entrepreneurial opportunities. The specifics of these ventures might not be widely publicized, but his diverse career suggests a willingness to explore different business avenues personal life. In an unforeseen turn of events on May 17, 2007, Mark Curry faced a life-altering incident when an aerosol spray dispenser, accidentally left behind a water heater, exploded. Engaged in the simple act of doing laundry at the time, Curry found himself burned on more than 20% of his body, including his arm, back, and side. This unfortunate accident led to months of arduous recuperation at his home highlighting the resilience and strength that would come to define Curry's journey. The explosion not only left physical scars but also took a toll on Curry's mental and emotional well-being. 
In a candid interview with the Associated Press on February 17, 2008, posted on CNN.com, Curry revealed the depths of his struggle. Seeking solace and understanding, he courageously went on the Montel Williams show to discuss his recovery openly. During this vulnerable moment, Curry shared that he had contemplated suicide after awakening from a daunting three-day medically induced coma. However, with the unwavering support of friends and fellow comedians, including Sinbad and Bill Cosby, Curry decided against this tragic path. The camaraderie and encouragement from his peers played a crucial role in helping him navigate the challenging journey of physical and emotional recovery. Despite the adversity, Mark Curry demonstrated remarkable strength, using his platform to shed light on the importance of mental health and the power of seeking support during challenging times. His openness about such a personal struggle has undoubtedly inspired others facing similar battles. While Curry has been candid about his professional and health challenges, he has maintained a more private stance regarding his personal life, including the identity of his wife. Nonetheless, it's known that Curry is married and, together with his wife, they share the joys and responsibilities of parenting two children named Gigi and Camellia. Thank you for watching the entire video. Leave us your comments in the section below. We hope you have found this helpful video. Don't forget to leave a like, share, and subscribe to the channel if you like it. Thank you for watching this, and see you in the next videos. Goodbye.